uh, dear friends, today I will show you uh, how to use the references software EndNote very easily uh, to arrange your references uh, in your manuscripts or, or in your thesis paper. So I have written one small paragraph. This is the paragraph having two references. So these are the references. So I will show you how you can use the EndNote to arrange your references. So first I will open the EndNote software. This is the EndNote uh, X4 software. So first you need to go to the file, then open a new options and then you will open a library for this manuscripts so i have opened a new library this is actually a short technique to arrange the references uh, manually so i will show you how to arrange the references manually so uh, this is the library uh, i have already created uh, to arrange the references for my documents so i will add the new new reference uh, here manually so this is the option i need to click now so if i click here this is for new reference so uh, if your uh, citation belongs to the journal article then you can select the journal article or if it belongs to the any book or electronic article or any other manuscripts then you can select from here or even thesis so um, I am going to add the references from journal articles. So I, I have selected the journal article here. Then uh, I will add the author here. So I will copy the first reference from uh, here. So first I will copy the, uh, the author name. I will add the author name here. Then here is the year. So the year is 1996. I have copied and paste the year here. And here is the title. So now I will copy the title. The title is from here to here. So uh, I have copied the title from here and title uh, need to paste here. So uh, I, I have already, already pasted all the information, author, year and title. So now I need to add. So if now I just click on the close, then it will say whether I need to save or not. So I will select the save here. So uh, I have already added the first first reference. So now the second reference in the similar way I will add. So first I will add the author name. I will copy the author name from here author name here then i will put the year here so this is the year so here i will put the title so this is the title now i will put the name of the journal so this is the journal name so i have i have put all the information of the second reference so now i will click the close button then i will click yes i want to save so here uh, you all see the two references i have already added here so uh, in the library of endnote so now i will add this reference uh, in the in this position so i'm going to add here the reference so uh, I, I need to put the cursor here. Then I will go to the EndNote. Then uh, I will here, I will click on the insert citation. So insert citation, if I click, then it automatically uh, put the references here. So I need to, uh, I want to highlight this. 
So and now and this is turn to the second reference. Now I will add the second reference. So here I will cleave the old reference. Now this is the second reference. So I want to add this reference. Now I will click here the insert citation. So the second reference is also added here in this list. So if I now remove the references before I edit, now I will, I will remove the references which I added before manually here. So these two references I have already added using the EndNote and I have added manually. So let's check the bibliography. So here you see mm, these two references are all also arranged here as a bibliography. So now I, I don't need this because already already the references added mm, uh, automatically using the EndNote. Actually, these are the easiest way to use EndNote manually to add references. So now I, I want to show you how you can change the reference style here. So here you see the EndNote Explore option uh, embedded uh, to the Microsoft Office. So if I click here, it will open another window here. Then if I want to change the reference style, then I need to uh, select here. If I select here another another option such as APA fifth, then I need to click here. Then if I uh, click here, update citations and bibliography. Okay, now, now all the reference style uh, is already changed uh, and uh, it, it has already changed uh, with our instruction uh, that's mean now the reference style is APA fifth so let's see another example if I want to change the reference style in different way such as a food chemistry journal so I need to select it and then if I click here update citations in bibliography then it, it, it will also change the style um, uh, according to the food chemistry journal so these are the very easiest way to add references in your journal or uh, in your articles, in your manuscripts, uh, even in your thesis papers. So I hope uh, this video is helpful for everyone. So uh, if you find this video helpful, I will request you all cordially to subscribe my channel and please stay with this channel. So thank you very much.